All right, Ron, thank you so much. Well, let's get on board the brain bus with Henderson County Schools. Megan Mortis is the public information officer, and she has the information. It's good to see you, Megan. It's good to see you. Thanks for having us. I just am fascinated by the title of the brain bus. So, what was the brainstorm behind the brain bus? Well, back in 2010, it was actually a community project started by the Henderson Leadership Initiative. And um, it had sustained itself after this project, and the schools adopted the bus, and it has been going strong ever since. What's on the bus? What's well, the experience of the bus? It is quite the experience. It is a mobile educational technology lab. It is full of laptops um, that have educational games. We have um, high-speed Wi-Fi. And this year, a new addition is that we added books to our Brain Bus so that students could take the accelerated reader test all summer long on the Brain Bus. What is, let's talk about that. Who's eligible for that and uh, how, how do you really test for it? Sure, um, our elementary and middle school students, um, they, can, they read books, chapter books, and then they take their accelerated reader test throughout the school year. Um, there are different challenges, different prizes that they receive. And um, usually we have it at the public library, which we do again this year. But this year we added it on the Brain Bus, and we were so excited about that. Do people make an appointment to get the Brain Bus to come to them, or do you have just a regular schedule? We have a regular schedule that we set up. It goes to different neighborhoods, to different organizations. This year we actually added it to the Reading in the Park which is a community partnership at Central Park and at Freedom Park at the fairgrounds. So we had the bus pull up there with all the kids and the parents, and they can get on the bus, they can play the games. Um, we have an instructor on board. And new this year also, we did our online registration, so parents and guardians could register for the next school year. Um, school's going to start August 8th. It's hard to believe. I can't believe that. Is it really August, August 8th? August 8th. Mm -hmm. So it's almost here. Almost here. Pre-registering helps then speed up that first couple of days of school, doesn't it? Absolutely. Yeah. We want all of our students to be registered as soon as possible before that first day of school. If they don't do it on the Brain Bus, what's the best way to do it? They can check with um, their local school or they can stop by the Board of Education office. We can assist them with that and they can do it from home. But if they have any questions, they can always call our technology for part department for assistance. What particular information do they need in order to register their young people? Um, they would need their name, emergency contact information, um, if their child has any allergies, immunization updates, and there are new Kentucky State immunization requirements this year, so they need all that information. Is that on your website? It is all on our website at henderson.kyschools.us, and you can also find the Brain Bus schedule there. Just a few more weeks left because there's only a few more weeks of summer left. Well, what happens with the Brain Bus in the winter? Well, we are really excited. It's actually going to be um, going throughout the school year at our Literacy Nights events. Um, at other community uh, events, and who knows, it might be even be in the Christmas break this year. The tragedy oh, certainly that is should the be in the Christmas epidemic. break this year. I think so. It's pretty colorful and pretty exciting to have it out there. Well, someday you'll have to drive it up here and let us take a little tour inside. Would oh, you do that, We Megan? will definitely so arrange that. To give that. our lifestyle audience a chance to see what's inside. Yes. Because I want to see what's inside, frankly. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. I may not drive it. I may be just a passenger. Okay, <laughs> you well, may you not want me driving it. You can guide us through all <laughs> the wonderful things I'll give you the tour. Absolutely. The <laughs> Megan, thank you so much for thank increasing you. the reading level in our community and educating our kids. Absolutely. Thank you so much. You can see the Brain Bus in Henderson. Give them a call. We'll be back with more local lifestyles. We'll be talking about the prescription.